just a joy to do. It's really good fun in the rehearsal. It's a really good night out. I think also, it's so iconic. Um, Beverly's just such an extraordinary character and it's full of brilliant, brilliant characters. And they're, even though it can feel quite extreme at times, it feels really truthful. Most actors would want to do Abigail's Party. It's a modern classic. It's got loads of comedy, loads of tragedy. People think that uh, Beverly is a, a monster, but actually she's um, she's the original Desperate Housewife, and she is lonely and angry and sad, and it makes her behave in some really atrocious ways. Lawrence is an estate agent. He's doing very well as an estate agent. He's making a lot of money. He's got lots of nice things in his house, but he's not very happy in his marriage. He's a bit of a snob. Susan is the mother of the eponymous Abigail and she is having a party at Susan's house, her house I suppose, um, and it's two doors down from where Beverly and Lawrence live. So she's come over so that she's out of the way. Angela is a working class nurse uh, and she doesn't really have a filter. Tony is a volcano. But there are loads of really fantastic lines. I think the one, actually one of my favourite lines is she just says all the time, yeah, great, fantastic. Beverly at one point goes, um, Lawrence, nobody else here likes olives. And he says, uh, not nobody, I like olives. And that is 25% of the assembled company. I'm going to choose my own because she's got some pretty great ones. Um, but it's, have you ever tried pilchard curry? <laughs> uh, there's way more to this play than you, you think there is because it's not just uh, a seminal performance by a rather brilliant actress. It's incredibly complex and highly entertaining. It's vibrant, it's painfully poetic, it uh, shines a light in so many ways on where we are politically and socially now. I think the audience watching it will see the light that shone on the consumerism that was very um, rife at that time and it was just beginning to take off and I think we're still in that but I think we're beginning to see how consumerism and capitalism is beginning to fall apart. It will be a hoot. You get to be a fly on the wall at a party from hell. <laughs>